I'm Joshua Van Berkham with uh, Motor City Technology. Uh, we're a Southeast Michigan uh, technology firm. Uh, we manage technology for businesses. Uh, our main verticals are law, insurance, uh, kind of any business with a lot of paper, has a lot of data. So we come into those particular businesses, really try to learn about their business, what their needs are, and on a case-by-case -case basis, we really try to adjust our offering to deliver value and, and efficiencies. Um, I believe that if we can help uh, a, another small business make money, then paying for our services is, is easy. A lot of the problems that we had with our website before was uh, I didn't think it was very professional, uh, which is a really bad way to start with not liking your website. Uh, there wasn't a lot of ways that we could capture information. Um, search engine optimization wasn't even something that we came close to, to achieving. So uh, for us, moving to the Joom Connect platform, not only did it solve all of those areas and uh, um, with gusto, but I really feel that now, I, I, my website, making it super professional, takes a very small amount of time from the blog entries that it, some of them are ghost written, some I do myself, um, and that all ties in. So if I want to write custom content, um, it gets added to a newsletter that goes out in print to my customers, which counts as a marketing touch. So we never marketed before, but now our website has kind of become the hub for all of our marketing. It sets up our print marketing, uh, our social networking ties into it. Um, it's just really super professional. My, my customers love it. And the technology part too is that now I do capture people's information. I've got landing pages for webinars and things of that nature and I, I don't even have to, to think about it. Uh, we just recently went through a, a very complicated rebranding. You go from being one company for 10 years and now all of a sudden you're a new company name and it's really to to have a local appeal was why we felt we needed a better name to better communicate to our customers who we are. So imagine you've got a year and a half worth of uh, email communications, um, newsletter, any kind of tips, physical newsletters, print newsletters, um, email newsletters that are all pointing back to articles that I've written. I, I can't have those break because people still do those. So. To be able to work with a vendor who said, yeah, 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 we're going we're gonna to help you transition to a new name and, and in completely transition to a new name. They're going to help me with the logo design, uh, the letterhead, the whole nine yards, but then also make sure that those links work and it communicates the message as to why we decided to change our name and who we are meant a lot to me. The, the biggest benefit that I have for, for me personally as, a, as an owner is it's really easy. I don't, I don't have to worry uh, about my website anymore. Uh, if we get really busy or I go on vacation, heaven forbid, and I can't pay a lot of attention, there's still content that shows up. That's good content. I have customers say, I love that content. So it, it's, it's content that occasionally may be ghostwritten, but it's content that is in sync with what I'm trying to communicate with my customers. So I would say the biggest benefit really is that they understand my message and they continue to communicate it clearly for me. We've been using the printed newsletter for about a year and a half now. Um, what's really nice is at times when, when we are growing, I get super busy and sometimes I'm not able to add content to the newsletter. It's not very often. I always try to have a couple things in there. Um, it looks unbelievably professional to the point that I've had customers say, can, can we, you come up with something like this for us? I mean, that's how much they really love the newsletter. Um, the newsletter, you know, obviously when you're sending out a, a beautiful branded, even the envelopes branded, so you're sending this out to your customers, I've got multiple people at customer locations saying, you know what, I didn't get your last month's newsletter, so-and-so gets it, can you please send it to me? Well, I've got some customers that have 150 people. I don't want to send one customer 150 news, newsletters because it'll break my bank. So in addition to having this great printed newsletter, they've got kind of a companion electronic newsletter. I, I only try personally to send the electronic one to existing customers. I will send anybody my print one because um, I feel that's a great marketing touch and it looks beautiful. But when I've had those people say, well, I really want your newsletter too at this, I'll just send them the electronic version and they're completely happy because it's really a mere copy of the newsletter and it's a free touch for, for my customers. So the electronic and the, the mailer newsletter have been uh, invaluable and that actually is my number one uh, drip marketing campaign. So fulfillment it has been really important to us especially since uh, 
you know, I guess we're not small anymore, but we were smaller. Um, and my bandwidth was really low. So a lot of time tasks consume me if it happens to be part of an important task. Whereas another important task, like a drip campaign, would fall by the wayside. That doesn't happen anymore because I've got fulfillment. I've got newsletters that are absolutely going out. I've got marketing campaigns that are, that are available to me. Um, I've got landing pages that can be uh, created for me and and that's really where the ball keeps rolling and which is so so important that kind of flywheel effect and that's I mean for me that's that's the proof in the pudding or, or where the rubber hits the road. Working with the staff at Directive has been a great experience. Um, uh, we, we got on to the uh, Joomla platform I, I think very early on. We were one of the, the first companies so we've been able to see it grow. And one of the things that's been exciting for me is it's improved leaps and bounds. So I, constantly things are being improved. Um, working with the staff has been great because there's been a couple of times that I've said, hey, I would really love to be able to do this. And if you work with other vendors and even other well-known vendors in the marketplace, well, that's going to be of cost and you get charged a ridiculous amount for it. And then you see them selling it ad nauseum to other people in the channel. And with uh, directive it's been a situation that's a really good idea I think that this can be a value to our other stuff so we're gonna cut you a really great break a few times it hasn't been of cost because they believe it's something that is of value to other people and to me that it just feels really great that uh, I'm a part of the process and I'm I, I you know it, it's like um, I feel like almost sometimes I'm a board of directors for the product that they're delivering because my ideas uh, have weight I would completely recommend uh, Directive and the Joom Connect product to other MSPs. Uh, if you don't have it, I think you're really missing out. Um, there are a lot of other solutions and solutions that I've had access to designed to kind of give the same type of full-featured MSP and I found that the search engine optimization isn't as good. The copy isn't as good. I can't call someone up and have a strategic conversation about the message I'm trying to convey and how should I adjust it and how can I better get listed here with with Joom Connect I call up and I have these strategic conversations you know probably a couple of few times a year which is great because the stuff changes so fast I need to be on top of it so it's it's been invaluable